I'm Erica Lopez with your e blog today. We are talking to another very talented Coloradan competing to be the last ninja standing on this season of American Ninja Warrior. Help me welcome 16 year old ninja rookie Hans Hertz. Thank you for joining me today. Thank you for having me here. OK, so big news. You just made it through to the semifinals. Congratulations. Thank you. Why did you want to become a ninja? There are so many ninjas <laughs> here in our state. What made you want to do it? Oh, when I was just flipping through the channels when I was like seven years old, found Ninja Warrior and I thought those obstacles were super cool. The production value was awesome. And then for my 10th birthday, I went there for a birthday party and I just fell in love with it since. And then finally, I was old enough to try out for the big show. I ended yeah. up getting on and I've just carried it on. They lowered the age now, so there's like all these, because you were 15 when, yep. when you got started on the show. And so you guys are all so incredibly talented. What kind of training has gone into prepping you for this first season on the show? Uh, I've been doing training for like six years now. I've been training with Caden uh, and Max, mm -hmm. who are also on the show, a whole bunch of other competitors. We've done plenty of course runs, training the upper body, lower body. I've started rock climbing to help all right. any of the other training. but. Yeah, just a load of upper body and lower body, making sure we're fit for any obstacle that they throw at us. Yeah, seriously, your uh, opponent that you were competing with in this last episode actually fell into the water, but you you crushed it all the way through. You made it through very quickly. Thank you. What kind of goes through your head when you're going through the course? Is are you just kind of focused, or run me through what's going through it's your actually, mind? When you run the course, like you're on the start line, you feel super nervous, but the second you start doing the obstacles, yeah. you get a little more confident as you go through each obstacle. But then all of a sudden, like I, for me at least, I hit a wall and then I just black out. Yeah. Most of the course, you just let the body take over. Yeah. And you just rely on all the skills the that you've muscle trained. memory, exactly. right, from all of your training. Yeah. Okay, so uh, a part of your platform this season has been that you're competing for your brother, Harper. Yeah. Can you share a little bit about that story for yeah, anyone who may not be familiar? So Harper has Rubenstein Tabby syndrome which is a physical and uh, mental disability that he has. So it's just really nice to be able to bring awareness for RTS and just get to like share my story with him. He's always there on my sidelines and always cheering me on. So it's really great that we got to share the show with uh, each other. And yeah. it's just helped grow a bond between us. So it's, it's great that we got to use that platform. Fantastic. Yeah. Well, Hans, I want to thank you so much for joining me today. Yeah. Best of luck on the rest thank of the you. season. You can't go wrong with all the Coloradans on the show, right? Because oh. you guys, you said you're friends. A lot of you train together and all that good stuff. Yeah. Absolutely. And you all can watch Hans and the rest of the gang on American Ninja Warrior Mondays right here on 9 News at 7 o'clock.